I don't wear earbuds, like, at all. And I know you're probably clutching your pearls going, but Paul, you've done all those earbuds reviews. That's because I have a good background and sound, but the reality is I don't like stuffing these things in my ears. They, they make me feel uncomfortable. Not only because I can't hear the world around me and I feel like I've cut off a sense, but also because I just don't like that feeling. It feels kind of like, Hello darkness, my old friend. The only time I wear earbuds is on flights because So when Oladance approached me and said, do you want to try our over-the-ear headphones? I was kind of like, yes, because sexy time. But the problem is, having done some research of my own into these things, all of the reviews on YouTube are from people who are like, hey, I'm good looking and seemingly innocuous. Why don't you buy these earbuds because I'm handsome? The video I've just watched has so many lies in it. So many lies. <laughs> Thanks to Oladance for sponsoring today's video and for sending me their 100% skin friendly, medical grade, liquid silicone, multi point Bluetooth, OWS Pro splash proof open ear headphones. Big words. But those words do actually mean something. This is the most comfortable pair of headphones I have ever worn in my life because they're basically not touching me at all. I should preface this review by saying that although those other YouTubers are flat out lying to you, there are a whole bunch of reasons that these are the only earbuds I will ever wear from now on. So stick around to find out why that is, but more importantly, wait until the end so I can tell you all of the lies you've been told. It's, it's juicy. Juicy. <laughs> One of the reasons these are the only earbuds I will ever wear from now on is that the battery life is pure insanity. And I mean this, I, I don't know how they're doing it. You get 16 hours from a full charge, which is six full hours longer than my former champion, the Soundcore Liberty 4 NCs. You also get a total playtime of 58 hours out of the case, which is eight hours longer than the Soundcore's 2. Eight hours longer! 15 minutes of charging will give you 6 full hours of listening time, but easily the most bizarre statistic here is the standby time, which will last up to 3 years on a full charge, thanks to what they're calling energy lock technology. Does Elon Musk know about this? He'd use these batteries to power his Teslas. Shut up, I'm using my genius to destroy Twitter. He knows, he knows what he's doing, doesn't he? Elon Musk, he... he he knows what he's doing. Why is he blue? Oh, um, have you not watched Ahsoka? He's basically in it. He's, he's in Ahsoka. Anyway, Andrew, um, not subscribed? After three weeks of watching me, according to you? I'm joking, I have no idea who you are. Um, <laughs> if you're not subscribed, I just freaked out all the Andrews. Do me a huge favor and just hit that button and uh, hit that bell and give me a thumbs up. Honestly, these things do matter. They actually tell YouTube, that's a good dude. We should push him to other people. You do me a huge favor if you do. Thanks, on with the show. So the primary feature of these things is that they are kind of invisible to you once you've put them on. That can't be it. It doesn't feel like I'm wearing anything. Like, literally not there. They really do feel so ridiculously comfortable that you will never want to go back to anything else. Here from the past is Paul from the past, wearing a particularly silly hat. So right now, I'm listening to Nora Jones, because, I mean, obviously I am. I'm 42. Um, but the weird thing is, I think I can have a perfectly ordinary conversation with somebody. And by perfectly ordinary, I mean reasonably ordinary, considering I'm wearing this hat. But I can hear everything around me from the stream over there to the traffic in the distance uh, to the cobbles beneath my feet. Everything just sounds like it would do if I wasn't wearing them at all. But I have the dulcet tones of Nora Jones as my soundtrack. Um, as if I'm some kind of hero in some very bizarre romantic comedy where people wear these hats. Well, awkward bumbling handsome noises. Eventually cheating on Liz Hurley with a hooker. 
This next feature though is entirely unique to these headphones. I have never heard of anything so preposterous, but they have a kind of noise cancellation. They're calling it focus mode because it's not really as good as noise cancellation, but the weirdest thing is it does kind of work. La 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 la. What? What? <laughs> what? That's really weird. La 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 la. So it's using basically the same technology as ANC as far as I can tell. It's firing opposing frequencies into your ear to cancel out the frequencies of the outside world. And it kind of cancels out things in the lower to mid upper mids where your voice range is so people talking are kind of like quietened down a bit it's kind of madness that it actually works but it does but probably the most impressive thing of all is the fact that they aren't leaking a great deal of sound hey check this out they're on pretty bloody loud right that's all you'd be able to hear as uh, somebody having a conversation with me i'm having to talk over it's quite loud in my ear <laughs> But to you, I'm guessing that doesn't make a lot of noise. The gestures is a su 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 squeeze, a su a su squeeze, a su squeeze. Oh yeah. It does take a little bit of getting used to, but you give it one su squeeze to get it to play and pause, a two su squeeze to get <laughs> to get it to skip to the next track. And three sequeezes will start the voice assistant on your phone so that you can pretend you're in Star Trek. You can also adjust the volume too with a little slider on the top, and this actually works really well. The sequeezes, you kind of have to get used to pinching and releasing, pinching and releasing, but the slider works really well. Like most earbuds these days, they are IPX4 splash proof, which means you can sweat all over them and, and get them rained on and it's fine. I've sweated on them a lot. They do stay on for a workout, and we'll talk a little bit more about that at the end, because I do feel a little bit like there are other YouTubers that might be... Dude, they, they will never fall out of your head. No, look. You see me go for... Look, look at me move my head. Look, look, I'm totally got... Look, just, they don't... They're not... They'll never fall out. Not ever, man. Like, look. They're still in my ears. It's incredible. <laughs> Gone. <laughs> they also have multi-point Bluetooth, and I've banged on about this before. This is a really important feature. It means that you can connect them to both your phone and your laptop simultaneously, so that if you're watching something on your laptop, but somebody rings you on the phone, you can actually listen to the laptop through the things and answer the call on those things simultaneously. So I've given these things a bit of a rough ride because I've compared them side by side with my favourite ever earbuds, the Soundcore Liberty 4 NCs. And these are my current reigning champions for sound and they are out of this world incredible. Um, a lot of other YouTubers are just like sticking them on the head and going, oh yeah, sounds pretty good. You have to compare them. You have to compare them to something you know is good. And the Soundcore Liberty 4 NCs are the best earbuds I've tried to date. Sounds weird. I'm gonna go out and get a drink sometime. No, I don't like you that way. I think we should just be friends. People say this channel is nothing but dad jokes. It's a sexy young man joke. There's nothing dad jokey about that. They sound amazing. Honestly, I, you would be forgiven for thinking that something like this would have no bass, like it would be devoid of low end. You would be wrong. These actually have an awful lot of low end. They have no right to sound this good! All I'm saying is that no audio file is going to pick these over, say, the sound cores or something similar, because those things are buried in your ear canal. They have a major advantage when it comes to sound. And this brings me on to my final point. I could wear these all day and all night and never feel any level of fatigue or any kind of discomfort whatsoever. And at some point... 66%! <laughs> 
Damn it. And at some point, you have to understand that the convenience of something like this outweighs the benefits of the perfect sound quality that you might get from other things. I will wear these every day of my life. I would not do the same thing with any other set of earbuds because the level of comfort is just completely unmatched. Just like the sound cores, you do have some control over the customization of the EQ. And though it's not quite as malleable, I have been able to get a really nice sound out of these that I'm perfectly content with. And now for all of the things that other YouTube reviewers have either entirely left out or flat out lied about. Here is the elephant in the room. Come on. Come on out and see you. The elephant in the room. They are expensive. Like, compared to, say, the sound cores, for example. The sound cores are cheaper and sound better, and that's where you have to kind of decide for yourself whether you're really, really into the sound of something, or whether you want the convenience and the comfort of something like this that sounds almost as good. At time of filming, the OWS Pros are 229 freedom units. Or in English money, that's 188 of our great British cups of tea. But this is the only headset you will ever use. You will use it for gaming, you'll use it for working out, you'll use it for walking around the streets. These things will provide you with a soundtrack to your life, and you won't feel like you have things wedged in your ears. You will feel like there is just music going on around you. The case is also humongous. It has to be to house something this shape. But it's worth bearing in mind that if you want to use these things, you either need big pockets or some kind of man bag. It is odd how a woman's purse looks so good on me, a man. <laughs> Initially, I found the gestures a little bit awkward, but you do get used to kind of press release, press release, press release if you want to triple tap. But the customization could be better. You can only customize both ears, you can't customize individual ears. So I can't have like a single click over here to start the voice assistant and a single click over here to pause the music. A single click on either of them will pause the music or start the voice assistant. You can't do both. Similarly, taking them out of your ear doesn't pause the music. I think it should. Um, if Ola Dance could update this via a firmware update, that'd be great, but I suspect it doesn't have a sensor to know whether it's pulled away from your face or not. You do kind of get used to just taking it out and squeezing as you take it out so that you pause it manually using a click. But uh, yeah, I think that would have been a good feature. And finally, just like Taylor Swift, I can shake them off. Gone. <laughs> How much Taylor Swift did I get out? How did I avoid the copyright strike on that one? Now I do have sweaty baby ears. Wow. And to be completely honest, I have worked out with them and it's been absolutely fine. I can do like the whole lying on my back thing and I can do the whole running thing and, and it's all good. Um, I think it's more of a feeling of insecurity that these very expensive things might fall off. And really, in reality, they do stay on. I think it's kind of more of a point that you have to get used to trusting these things and I think it's worth mentioning that you will feel awkward when you wear them because you don't want to lose them and they do feel kind of like loose on your head. At least with my tiny little baby face. Uh, perhaps you have a big fat man face. <laughs> what? Um, that's me. I, I don't really like earbuds. I really, really like these. If you're like me and you like the idea of having music all the time and you suffer with ear fatigue or you don't like the idea of having something like wedged into your ears, these are perfect and I would urge you to pick some up if you can afford them. As I say, they are quite pricey, but as usual, there are links in the description as to where you can pick one up. In the meantime, I hope you've enjoyed today's video. If you have, it's thanks to these people. These are my patrons from Patreon, and without them, this video would not be here. I would be working in a call center. If you want to be one of those incredible people, you can do that at either Patreon or buy me a one-off beer at PayPal, and either way, I'll genuinely love you forever. These are my Facebooks and my Twitters and my Instagrams and my TikToks too, and it's not called Twitter, it's called X. See you next time. Well, they have a kind of noise cancellation despite the fact your ear is open. It's like they're firing... <sighs> They're connected to that too. And if your phone rings, you can answer that on the call as you go. Eh? <laughs>